So one of the things that we have to do in pediatrics in particular is make sure that the child is comfortable, make sure that they're not afraid of the physician, make sure that they um, recognize that it's not necessarily going to end in a shot um, because they're worried about that. So I generally have an approach when I walk into a patient's room to immediately see what they're playing with, whether they're on their phone playing Pokemon Go, and then I can compare my Pokemon Go account with theirs, or if they're playing on the on the floor with race cars, I'll often get on the floor and, and start playing with the child first before digging into the medical aspects of it all. I try to make some comments and, and bond with the family and the patient before really you know, testing out the sore elbow. The first thing that um, often I have to do is figure out a diagnosis and to put that into a coherent whole is sometimes tricky in the field of rheumatology. The second phase will be once we know what the diagnosis is to design um, a reasonable therapeutic and treatment protocol that balances the need to feel better um, with the recognition that some medications have some side effects that we like to minimize. So it's a constant conversation with the family, with the patient, um, and with medical care providers, uh, possibly with other teams of physicians to balance the goals of the patient and the family with the recognized complications of treatment. Yeah, what do I find most rewarding about um, pediatric health in general? I think is the, you know, the, the happiness, the smile, the, the joy of a child who's no longer in pain, no longer suffering. They, they come in, they're happy, they're smiling, they can run, whereas before they were limping from their arthritis. Those are the things that I, I find most rewarding. Mm -hmm.